it's trucking. I'll tell you, this is a, a very nice little road. This is a very super nice little part of this nice little road where you, you drop down in. I mean, you literally drop down into this turn. And then you power right out of it. I dig it. I dig it. What can I say? Oh, it's school bus time. Man, I hate school bus time. Uh, today is May 21st. It's um, absolutely gorgeous out. And um, as you can see, I'm wearing my fingerless gloves, so it's not super cold. But I am wearing my leathers, but I'm wearing a sleeveless shirt underneath my leather. You know, go figure. Um, it's cool out today. I think when I left the house, it said it was 63. Optimistically, the spider is saying it's 69, down from 71. And, uh, you know, I get tired and I get cold. So I knew I just, I throw my leather on. Um, that way it's, it's nice and dark and it'll help absorb some of this beautiful sun that we have today. And it'll, it'll keep me warmer. And then underneath I can just wear a sleeveless shirt because if I wore about anything else, I'd probably be a little too warm. So uh, definitely white trashing it up today. But it's, it's gorgeous up through here. We get just enough elevation that, you know, you can look over the little valley here. And uh, I love this farm. It's just absolutely gorgeous. And the backdrop of the valley behind it. And uh, like I said, it's, it's a tiny, tiny, tiny little hill. But that's all you need sometimes, get some nice views. And uh, I don't know where I'm going today. I, I don't think I'm going to be out very long. And yes, we are recording, so that is good. Make sure we're plugged in. Plugged in, plugged in, plugged in. I think I'll shoot down Coon Path. I should be at home mowing grass or better yet, making a, a video. But, uh... I decided to come for a ride because I got the email today that says, hey, you guys are so busy that uh, you might want to think about putting in some overtime, but we understand you're busy, so don't worry about coming into work this week. <laughs> you know, so it's a, hey, we're going to give you too much work that you can handle, but you don't have to worry about coming in, so... That's kind of exciting. I think I'm going to take them up on it. That way I don't have to worry about commuting, keep the miles off the car and the spider. And uh, maybe make a little bit of money. The problem is, though, after so many hours, your brain is just toast. It's marshmallow. It's You, you can't think. You know, you, someone could ask you what 2 plus 2 is, and you wouldn't even know what they're saying, let alone that there's numbers in there and they want you to add them together. And uh, I'm a simple person, I really am. I, I, I speak simply, I, I do things simply, you know, definitely uh, work smarter, not harder is my philosophy. So to, to switch from uh, using my hands to, this dude is going super slow. So now I have to use my noggin. It, 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 it's difficult at times, to be honest with you. But hey, I'm out on this gorgeous ride on this gorgeous day, even though it is cool. But I think this is going to be the, like the last cool couple days we're going to have. I think um, they said it, it's supposed to get up to like 88 degrees. Nice easy pass. Plenty of visibility around him. No shenanigans. And I'm I'm not I'm not riding quick. Um, my speedometer on the spider is off by three miles per hour. So it's saying right now I'm doing 54, but I'm coming into this little turn, so I'm slowing down a little bit. Um, you know, so when you see me and it's saying 58, I'm, I'm probably doing 55. Now, when I change the back tire and I go with a 215.60, 
and then my speedometer is only off by one mile per hour but it, it doesn't bother me being off I know it's off and it's off to my advantage so I don't care but this is a very nice relaxing ride usually not a lot of traffic on this road and that's why I take it and I mean Andrew's not too awful bad. So we're coming up on Memorial Day, and uh, you know I really, I really respect what Memorial Day stands for. You know, especially now that we have family that's in the military. It's a completely different way of looking at things. You know, my grandfather served, and my dad. I, I, it was weird. He got sent over to Vietnam for some school thing. Um. I don't quite understand how that works. But with our son-in-law in the military and, and being deployed for nine months and, you know, they have training where he's gone for 30 days at a time. I mean, it's just... Oh, look at that little motorcycle. Gravel boo. You know, it really opens your eyes on what a family goes through. You know, they have they had a little boy. They're expecting their second child here shortly. Someone be a a pom pom because that's my name, pom pom. I'm gonna be a pom pom three times now. Hmm, where am I going? Road is closed. Well, that's just a bunch of bull crap. Open to Gun Barrel Road. Well, I don't know Gun Barrel Road. Let's go this way. Oh, oh. Like I said, I don't know where I'm going. I really don't care. I'm just out for a ride. But, uh, you know, like I said, he's been deployed for nine months. Iraq, Syria border, which was super scary. You know, and everything that my daughter had to go through and what he had to go through, too. I mean, it's just... Uh, it puts a lot of stress on a marriage. It really does. You know, so I want to I definitely want to thank everybody for who served and the families that have stand by him. I mean, it's it's truly unbelievable, and, and my heart goes out to all of them. So uh, you know, thank you for your service. Thank you, families, for for letting your loved ones uh, go off and, and fight. So I can do this. And uh, I don't know if I'm going to be around on Memorial Day. I might be. It might be a day of transit for me. Uh, I started a new team, and then I I moved to another new team. So, and this is all at work. And uh, my boss was talking to me yesterday, and she's like, "You know, you have Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday off." And I'm like, "No, I don't." She's like, "Yeah, you put the time in," and I'm like. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> so I, I, I'm giving the time back and I'm on work Thursday, Friday. But then I started thinking, I'm like, man, I could have went somewhere. Like, hardcore went somewhere. So, of course, you know, now my mind is, oh, you know, if I can leave at 3 o'clock since I'll be working from home, I wonder what little road this is. We're, we're going to go out it. We're going to turn right. Um... So my mind, you know, if I can leave at 3, whew, I can put in, you know, till 9 o'clock and it's still kind of light out. So that's, that's some time. I can, uh, I can go somewhere. So I'm, I'm trying to decide if I want to go north or if I want to go south. That's a big scoop bus. Big scoop bus. So, you know, some of the things I was thinking of is um, the Upper Peninsula, Michigan. That'd be kind of cool. The Mackinac Bridge on the Spider. Um, another one is, um, you know, of course, I love the Smoky Mountains. So, maybe the Blue Ridge Parkway? I don't know. We'll see. 
wife's looking right now at ooh, look at this sharp little turn um, what the temperatures and weather are supposed to be like for this weekend well I dig this little road so I will probably get this one upload and just it'll be sitting there and ready to turn live um, That way I can just hit a I can hit a button on my phone and I can go live, you know. I gotta give thanks to the all of our soldiers, men and women and moms and dads and brothers and sisters and aunts and uncles, you know. Because without them, I I, I literally would not be able to do this. Oh, this is bringing me right back around, because that's the I just passed that. I'm cool with that. I'll just do some uh, some farmland, and you can see, you know, it's it's fairly flat through here. We got some little hills and whatsoever you got, you can call it, but um, you know, it, it's not as oh. okay, elder. So I'm on. I'm on a road. I don't care. It's a decent little road, too. It, it's not too bad. You know, usually you get on these roads and you got really bad off-camber turns and a lot of dips. You know, I've had a couple where it's kind of taking the breath out of me, like right there. But uh, all in all, it's not a bad little road. I still feel very comfortable on the spider on this road. But it is very twisty and it keeps changing. Richland. Oh, the hiccup-ups. Getting the hiccup-ups. So I think I'm going to leave it there since I'm getting the hiccup-ups. Give me a thumbs up if you liked the video. Stay safe, everybody. Everybody have a safe weekend. And once again, I want to thank all the soldiers that do what they do so I can do what I do. Stay safe, everyone. I'll see you in a couple days.